Hey everyone, welcome back for more EXO Zero's content. In today's video, we're going to discuss another new update. Actually, we were expecting this already and we we're just waiting for this. I'm a bit surprised that this dropped early, as early as Tuesday. Oh, sorry, as early as Monday. So basically, the collaboration is with Tales of Vesperia. So this will be the update that I'm going to discuss now, plus the other things that I'll be discussing uh, after this one. So basically, Tales of Vesperia will be um, dropping as a collab update on Thursday. And um, this has been, you know, um, I, I read the posts actually, and some of you guys were looking forward to Danmachi but this drop but some of you guys are also happy that this dropped so i hope um you guys will be happy that we're going to have this this thursday so um just a small update on tales of Vesperia. so Re remastered download edition is on sale so they're going to have um a remastered version of the game dropping in ps4 nintendo switch and um Please check out the game's official website here. Okay, so moving on to Tales of Vesperia collaboration, new heroes and exclusive weapons update. So the first that we're going to dis be discussing is hero Yuri Lowell Flynn Sif Sifo chance increase. So February 25 after the update up to March 4. So I won't go into the details of each hero. Just you can just actually read this post through Facebook. And um, here we have uh, Yuri Lowell. So skill information will be added after the skill balance is confirmed. So probably a couple of days from now, we'll be have um, more on their skill information. So collaboration hero Flynn Sifu chance increase. So also on February 25 after the maintenance um, up to March 10. So here he is below and um so as well your skill information will be added after the skill balance has been confirmed so collaboration heroes are not eligible for recruit other than the, the than the limited recruitment so i think based on this they'll be available only through their banners so after the end of the tales of vesperia collaboration limited recruit here will not be included in the list of other acquisitions so they will just be available during their banners okay so limited edition if you want them on your teams if you want to get them you must get them now um during uh, the event when the event drops on february 25. so collaboration here is going to be obtained in terry dice station coliseum in door creation etc okay so collaboration hero estelle is not eligible to get free recruit number one the limited recruit uh yuri is actually 0.5 percent to get so she's like um he's like a fated um character um also for flynn flynn could be also a fated character um but not what you call not not what not not on a general level because his um his chance for recruit is 0.7 percent so earn one recruit mileage when you recruit heroes at 11 times. So similar, in order to achieve a definite recruit, Yuri Lowell, you must acquire 28 mileages. So it's like they're going to be similar to Fated type of hero, but um, the banner is like you're like recruiting for a for a Fate core. So I hope that, you know, um, they should have reduced this number to basically um i'm sorry they should have increased the, the the chance to get for these um what they call this these heroes because they're not of fate gore um level and they have their their weapons as well so yuri lowell so second star so exclusive weapon again i'm not i don't know if if you should get their weapons um, if you really like the character, go for it. Um, that that is what I always say. If you really love the character and you have uh, you have extra zest to spend, then you get um, their exclusive weapons because they look better with with uh, with their exclusive weapons. So the other one, actually, the the rate is actually zero point five percent. So again, uh, pretty much hard to obtain. And Flynn Sifo, 
white white knight sword is also a a what they call this exclusive weapon he um the rarity of this one is 0.7 percent similar to his um hero so again if you like um the heroes if you like them and if you want to pull for them and if you really really want to pull for the weapon then go ahead but again um just a caution a precautionary you know tale let's check out first their skills we haven't seen their skills yet um um i'm not sure if if they are you know they are yet um they are now worth investing in because we don't have their skills yet but as soon as you have seen their skills maybe you can decide for yourself okay so we go to estelle so estelle is also dropping um after the march 4th maintenance so she's basically a one one week delayed um, up to March 10th that is why she's going to be she's she, she was featured here um, um, from them so also Flynn Sifu is going to be um, I think with her but yeah she's going to be with her up to March 10th so this guy is going to be um, featured for the recruitment banner for two weeks basically so um Again, if we go back, it's going to be Yuri for one week, Flynn for two weeks, and um, you have Lowell here for a week as well. So your bridge there would be Flynn. Flynn will, will be with uh, Yuri, and Flynn will be with Lowell for the second week. So that's, that, that's about it. So again, uh, Estelle has her rod. So again, if you like the character, if you like her skills that she's going to, you know, be using, you can actually go for her, you know, for her exclusive weapon. And um, again, the chance for Estelle is, I think, 0.5 as well, because Estelle is going to be um, a f kind of level of uh, a gold fate core in terms of recruitment uh, rate. And her weapon as well is 0 0.5. Okay, so we go now to the update number two. So we have, um, this is going to drop the Core Raid shop. So a Core Raid will open with basically the three of them. So it's going to drop on February 25th after the maintenance to, to March 10. Um, extreme, for extreme up to special difficulties. So these are the um, that that is these are the items that are going to drop in the shop. Okay, as follows. So again, you know what the core raid is. It's usually um, a group of three heroes that you defeat. Um, um, like for example, low level, mid, and high level to get you know to get items uh, or to get um, to get uh, special items actually for your teams to use so you can participate in the core raid after clearing the main story 7-11 basic items become purchasable after a certain amount of time raid items can be updated up to a certain step st stage by resetting the step reward collaboration core raid will not included in the infinity core okay so they're not going to be placed in the infinity core for the collaboration core raid okay so again for your for this core raid you will have their yuri lowell and um the other guy <laughs> forgot his name that's my problem anyway you'll 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 have um um tales of vesperia core raid open on thursday february 25. okay so you also have seven days of gifts so this will be a login event for seven days so here are the rewards this will be starting on february 25th after the maintenance as well day one 200 zest day two 500 gold 500,000 gold book of experience on day three times 70. day four is die coupon times 50. day five is nation recruit ticket times five day six is 500 zest and day seven tales of Vespera collaboration hero flynn sifo so basically flynn will be will be added here as a probably a free character but i don't know why they still put it there as uh, one of them in the banners 
But anyway, if you don't want to play for uh, to to pull for Flynn, he is actually available here in day seven of your seven days of gifts. Okay, so precaution: the gifts we received from Leafy will be sent to your mailbox. Uh, uh, event reward mail uh, expires in three days or after three days. Okay, so new as far as the new story chapter sixteen update, so. We have here a new story, Baelish and Emma Heroes meeting 40 years ago will be updated. Or I think this is 40 years previously, not 14 years. Yeah, 14 years ago. Sorry. Um, hero birthday system updates. So we'll be able to use the hero birthday system already for additional freebies. Every hero in the game will have their own birthday and... Um, if you have one of the heroes achieve 99 level 90 you can receive 100 zest for hero birthday so basically they have to be of level 90 for you to receive their hero birthday hero celebrates his or her birthday the birthday icon ui will be displayed on the left side of the world air squadron menu after moving the air squadron birthday ui will be displayed on the left side the hero manage menu okay a birthday pop-up will appear when you move the hero uh, oh, oh. anyway the point is for you to get a reward it's going to be you're going to require you're going to be required to have that hero to be level 90 okay so air squadron promotion board update the air squadron promotion board update will be to promote the air squadron that i belong okay two hashtags may be used for promotional postings using hashtag you search uh, what to join this i will have to uh, to be honest with you guys i will have to test this out um, in terms of the promotional board um for me this is just a this is just a announcement board for your air squadron okay Theria die station closet system update again so this will be a closet system wherein you can save um previously previously com you know previous combinations of colors for your heroes then if you want to change the color again you can summon then save this through your wardrobe so that you can pull this out if you want to use it again signature force for schmidt so si vagabond enhanced level will be added throughout this update so vagabond enhanced level will be open to 3-4 Signature Force is a system that can strengthen the hero, blah, blah, blah. Yes, I know. And um, it's basically going to start from 3-1 and add slight element damage to, uh, to heroes from Vagabond. 3-2, Smith status increase. 3-3, increase status of heroes of Vagabond nationality. Reduce elemental damage of heroes of Vagabond nationality. And actually, I have... Um, read this in advance in terms of the special type bind change effect this won't really affect gameplay it's the wording that's going to change like for example for bind the what we know bind is that it automatically does not you know have, for example if you have bind on your enemies they won't gain mana depending on the how many terms it's specified there so bind right now will be will be used in a general sense of the word like for example you bind and binds binds gain mana so binds gain mana means he doesn't gain mana um also here in in terms of um, barriers or binds barriers so he doesn't gain barriers so that's it that's the difference i don't think we'll have any change in their stats in their mechanics it's more of the wording that's going to be changed here Okay, now for your announcement three. So login screen change system update. Um, Eternal bond. So again, for the new Eternal bond, uh, starting on March twenty seventh, Saturday after the update. Uh, sorry, after the update up to March twenty seventh, um, we have the opportunity to change our Eternal bond. So the choices will be carry and Garf. So I'd go for Garf because I'm wasted red. So. Uh, for you guys, probably um, for those who want to build up carry, now is the a good time to get a copy of carry after 30 days of Eternal Bond. So Hero Battle, Mitron's new and Hero Battle where you can obtain heroes is being opened. Hero Battle is here. 
<laughs> okay, my fault. So Hero Battle, me, me, they're going to give away Metroid. I haven't been reading this part yet. Sorry. So for your hero guide, uh, the hero that they're going to give out is Metroid. Simply, you Pierce Labyrinth. Um, you will have new gimmicks again for for March. Exos Pass March. Exos Pass is opening uh after update up to march 24th okay so past battle i won't go into monthly season mission would also restart so for those of you out there who have uh, who have uh, what do you call this who have uh, finished this one early so it's going to reset after the update as well and community payment going to reset for those whales out there and these are the rewards okay so they're going to throw in injured awakened zeon here um okay and choice fate core event choice fate core others tales of Vesperia collaboration scene challenge mission ui improvements okay it's a well it had a couple of bugs so it's good that they're going to put out improvements to this skip hero effect okay new package update so sale period for bright 24 up to march 4 package details new encounter recruit package so more on these when we start the game i'll try to you know take a look at them and see if uh, usually for packages anyway then while i'm here i'm just gonna take a look at them so more or less for 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 your packages the most valuable would be obviously this and nation recruit tickets and um ultimate orb would be good as well this one so this is 15 and this is 30 ultimate orbs these are usually good as long as if you have them you know if you have the resources to spend um that's it so basically i would recommend uh new encounter recruit package this one this one and this one so three package then ultimate or package one ultimate or package two so those are you know i've actually i, I remember i i purchased them in the past and I, if you need you know to, to develop your heroes the, the ultimate or package is actually very good bug fixes along the way so you have a bunch of bug fixes that will improve the, the game again um this is the end of this update more or less for this update um pretty much again average update um hopefully when they drop schmidt and um and who's the other one kylock for the black and white theme probably in march hopefully we can get better you know uh more content and better content so that you could you know support as well the 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 veterans who have been playing this game since day one so anyway guys um hope you like this update comments in the comment section below also please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet anyway this is the warden guys take care and i'm out